as the built environment advances to tackle the problem statements of tomorrow, the Department of the Built Environment is excited to offer a new undergraduate offering, the Bachelor of Engineering in Infrastructure and Project Management. The proposed program is unique in Asia and is the first full-time engineering undergraduate program with a strong focus in project management. The degree is the result of high levels of interest and demand for undergraduates with such skills amidst global trends. The degree provides students with relevant skills and knowledge in the areas of engineering, management and law. This provides students a wider choice and greater flexibility in planning and charting their career pathways. One of the few that I would specifically mention is the e-studios that are scattered around the SDE campus. In the e-studios, there are many computers available for students to use and the software inside the computer range from energy resources to building modelling. The professors are really amazing. When we have doubts, you know, our professors will always be there to answer our questions, to address our concerns. They are able to interact with students and understand how we are feeling and will always check in in terms of our well-being and how we are coping. From this uh, academic program, I've learned a wide overview of all the different uh, themes of the built environment. From what I can bring over to the internship is that I know what is going on behind the contracts, I know what is the liability of each party in the construction sector. In this 5G Centre for Digital Building Technology, uh, we introduce 5G technologies integrated with Digital Twin and 5G Robotics. In our centre, our students will acquire the necessary skills and knowledge to better manage and enhance the built environment. Centre for 5G Digital Building Technology is a newly set up centre. The students will be given hands-on training on their usage and encouraged to use them extensively to conduct their module projects and future research. And so we're helping our students understand the future of how buildings are operated and managed and how infrastructure is operated and managed. We're teaching students uh, data literacy skills. So we're teaching them how to code, we're teaching them how to process and analyze large data sets. It's a new skill set that almost every industry is looking for. And we're now uh, one of the few that's providing that type of education for built environment. My current role is with uh, McKinsey and Company, and I'm with their sustainability practice. You know, we look at what the clients want to achieve in terms of uh, decarbonisation of their portfolio. My undergraduate programme has allowed me to build up uh, knowledge in terms of the green building sphere. That has allowed me to you know, understand uh, sustainability needs in depth on one sector. And for Singapore, it's to hit net zero by 2050. And to hit net zero, it means that all the corporations within Singapore has to be net zero in terms of emissions. So I think the potential for graduates will be huge because there will be a high demand for people in this uh, area. Currently, I'm a manager with the System Management Department with uh, SMRT Trains. So we oversee the asset lifecycle management for MRT stations as well as depots assets. So the practical knowledge actually helped me with my early days of my career. This knowledge actually complement with the fundamentals for the asset lifecycle management and subsequently helped me in my career now. I would say come in with an open heart and an open mind. Cherish the opportunity to study not only in NUS but in our department as well because there's a lot of opportunities for you to develop. If you're interested in the sustainability, if you're interested in the built environment, I think DBE is a place where you can uh, realise your potential and gain a lot of knowledge in which is really the upcoming part of what the world needs and what Singapore needs to have a sustainable building environment. If uh, you are interested in uh, contributing to the sustainable built environment and uh, you enjoy doing engineering work and maybe management work uh, in future, this is definitely a course for you.